Good morning, warriors. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I'm Adriana. I'm Brianne. I'm Luke. I'm Larry. I'm Chris. And I'm Ruby. And you're watching Warrior News. Good morning, Warriors. Today is October 16th, a B-Day here at Windsor High. Hello, I'm Taria. And I'm Todd. Next week is the most exciting week of the year. It's Spirit Week. Classes will be competing against each other to see who will be crowned 2015 Spirit Week champion. Each day, students should come to school representing their class by dressing according to the theme of the day. Monday is Pajama Day. Tuesday is Tacky Day. Wednesday is Way Back Wednesday, where students will dress as they did in any decade prior to the year 2000. And Thursday, you will come dressed representing your hallway theme. Freshmen have Egypt, sophomores have Paris, juniors have Hong Kong, and seniors have Hawaii. This Friday will be Spirit Day. Then Friday will be Spirit Day. Students should come wearing school apparel or colors. Concluding Spirit Week is the homecoming dance. Tickets will go on sale Monday. On Monday and Tuesday, tickets will be discounted at $8, and from Wednesday to Friday, tickets will be 10 Last year, the dance sold out. Only a limited amount of tickets will be sold, so get yours early. This is a semi-formal event. Remember, students from other schools are not allowed to attend. Attention all seniors. There will be a short meeting after school on Monday to prepare for hallway decorating, which will be on Wednesday at 3.30 p.m. If you are interested in participating to help us win, please come to Ms. Sola's room at 2.35 p.m. on Monday. And now, here is our proud leader, Mr. Sills, with some important community service information on this week's principal's message. Good morning, Windsor Warriors. Welcome to a Friday here at Windsor High School. We're in the red tile lobby today talking about community service. The reason we're starting here is because Mr. Bianchi's community service office is just right around the corner. Just a reminder before we go take a look at and visit with Mr. Bianchi, everybody who graduates in the class of 2017 and after, 18, 19, 20, you guys need 20 hours of community service in order to graduate, and it has to be recorded in our online uh, volunteer service uh, software program. So let's go talk, see Mr. Bianchi. I want to see, show you where the room was so you know where to come find him. Down here on the J Hall. So ladies and gentlemen, here we are at J101, the home of community service here at the high school. One of the nicest people that we have in the building works in here. This is Mr. Steve Bianchi. Mr. Bianchi, good morning. Good morning. How are you today? Good. How are you? We're bringing everybody on the TV show down to see you to say hi so they can figure out where you are and kind of get to meet you so they learn how they can work with you to get their community service hours. Nice. Anybody can come in. The door is always open. We are at J101, the music hall, extension 337. Give me a call on my cell, 860-209-9194. Come on down. There's a lot of fun things happening here. Excellent. Thank you so much, Mr. Bianchi. We appreciate everything you do for You're us welcome. at Windsor High. You're welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, have a great day. Come see Mr. Bianchi. Sign up for community service hours, and let's get everybody graduated on time at Windsor High. Have a great day. Thanks, Mr. Sills. Ms. White asks that we honor those who have fought breast cancer and won the fight, as well as those who struggled and did not beat the disease by having a wear pink on Wednesday to support Breast Cancer Awareness Month. All of us have had, relative, have had a relative, a neighbor, or a friend who has been stricken with this disease. This disease strikes men as well as women. So, we are declaring Wednesday, October 28th as Windsor High wears pink on Wednesday. Students planning to attend the CT Youth Forum field trip on Tuesday, October 20th, check your student email for your permission slip. Let Ms. V know by returning her email if you will be attending. Permission forms must be turned in no later than Tuesday at 9 a.m. to attend. Forms are also available in the main office. Also, there will be a French Honor Society meeting on Monday at 2.30 in room B111. Attention, staff, and students. This is a reminder from Ms. Schultz that no fundraising activities can be held without the approval of the administration. There is a brief form for folks to fill out. Advisors have copies of it in their advisor handbook. Others can get copies from Ms. Ramadi. 
the complete form is to be returned to Principal Schultz, Vice Principal Schultz. There are many considerations when a fundraising event is approved, including Town of Windsor and State of Connecticut guidelines. Any student interested in working on the WHS Literary Magazine is asked to sign up on the bulletin board by E204. The magazine needs people to edit, lay out, and create this year's edition. Any questions, please see Ms. Jackson in room D219. The school counseling department wants you to know that we will be having our annual college fair here at Windsor High in the auditorium and cafeteria on October 20th from 6.30 to 8 p.m. All are welcome and encouraged to come. There will be 140 colleges and military representatives available for questions. Even if you attended last year, it's still a great idea to come out again this year. We hope to see you there. It's time again for Poetry Out Loud. Poetry Out Loud is a national poetry recitation contest that starts in schools and concludes in a national competition in Washington, D.C. If you're interested in poetry and or performance or the idea of winning prizes and scholarships, you should participate. Ms. Green POL after, Ms. Green's POL after schools workshop is open to anyone, especially students not participating with their English classes. The first workshop will be held in the library on October 26th. See Ms. Green with any questions. There is a forensics club meeting on Monday, October 19th. Anyone interested in the study of crime is welcome. We will be planning our Spirit Week poster and planning for a field trip to the JFK Family Science Night on November 13th. The volleyball team needs your help to make tonight the best Dig Pink Night yet. All proceeds will go to the American Cancer Society. You can donate one or more dollars, purchase a, com a compression sleeve, and snacks from the concession stand. See a volleyball player or coach Wooded for details. Come out and show your support tonight and wear pink. There will be a blood drive once again in the rubber gym on October 30th. Mr. Chris's introduction to health careers students will be recruiting donors. Did you know that one pint of blood can potentially save three people? Plus, you get lots of free food. You must be at least 17 years old on the day of the drive to donate. You may also see Mr. Christus in room D107 for an appointment card. The Windsor Online School Store is now open. They have apparel for all sports and many styles. So check it out and represent the dub with some new gear. Just go to the school website and click on the link to get to the store. And speaking of gear, the softball team is once again selling Windsor ear warmers. And with the cold weather coming, you will want to get a pair. They're only $10. See Mr. Alexander or Mr. Mahdi in the main office to get yours today. Attention club presidents, sports captains, and staff. You can email announcements to jgooden at windsorct.org to get information on the show. We also encourage photos and videos from our events, games, and your classroom. Let's share with everyone the amazing and exciting things that happen here. Thanks for checking out our show. And remember, if you don't see the news during Block 2, you can follow us on Twitter at WHS Warrior TV, where we post every episode and much, much, much more. That's all for today. And remember, we are respectful. We are responsible. We are proud. We are warriors. Have a great day and tweet us the pics of your club sports and events to get them on the news.